Although our opening of Murder at Melly Ranch is quickly approaching, our troop has been totally distracted by Pamela's arrest. Oh! 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 oh. But it was an accident! Oh yes, of course it was. Officer, arrest her. Yes, ma'am. Melinda, be reasonable. It was totally innocent. I'm sorry, sir. But this battle is putter much. You are hereby under arrest. Anything you say can and will be used against you on a court of law. Want to hold something against me, detective? Pamela's out on bail now, but to say the least, her mind really isn't on our show. My own! Pamela, we're all waiting for you to rehearse. In case you forgot, we're opening this show in a couple of days, and we're not nearly ready, mainly because of distractions caused by you. And as for you, you're causing me a lot of agita, you know, buddy? I, I know, Ben. I'm sorry. Yeah, me too. Well, if it isn't too much trouble, I'd like to get on with rehearsal. I'll be right there. Sorry, looks like I got you in trouble. It's all right. I'll see you tomorrow. You'll talk to Melinda? I'll try. You gotta convince her to drop these ridiculous charges. All right, I said I'll try. Dad, do you know anything about this unpaid reservation? Unpaid? Gee, sweaty. Sweetie. I can Sweetie. I can't imagine. Now, well, let me just take a look. Who is it for? Somebody named Harriet Harlett. First class accommodations. No cash, no credit card, no nothing. Is this one of your special deals, Daddy? Because we can't afford any freeloaders. We have bills to pay, Daddy. I mean, really. All right, that's OK. Uh, let's take five. What's going on, honey? How can we help? Yeah, I know what it's like to be arrested. Did that cop molest you? No, it's nothing like that. It's just Al. He's hiding something from me, and I don't know what it is. Look, if he loves you like he says he does, then why doesn't he just leave his wife? Then you wouldn't be committing adultery, right? Yeah, why won't he leave her? I wish I knew. I feel like such a fool. There's something fishy about this. I'm gonna get to the bottom of it. Tell Ben that I had to leave. Don't tell him why. Miss Bo. Now what? It seems I have some bad news for you. These photographs were obtained from the Delhi security camera next door and indicate that you violated the conditions of your bail by continuing to engage in adulterous behavior with Mr. Spuddlesnooks. But we didn't do anything wrong. I'm afraid you'll have to come downtown with me. Your bail is hereby revoked. Now we're really in the soup, so to speak. Not me, you go around your forever ever. Oh, Daddy, you've got to pay more attention to the bank accounts, Daddy. Our Lulu. Yep, Clark's got it in his head that he can play both parts simultaneously. Gabby the cook, our homage to Gabby Hayes, and Louise. Crazy, huh? <laughs> but honestly, I haven't come up with a better idea. I'm also worried about Alexis. She disappeared after Pamela's meltdown, and we haven't heard anything from her. I've got no clue where that's going. Well, I guess we'll find out together. Next time on the troop. I am a coolie guy, I do. I can make anything you want. A boo boo, goo 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 poo, a car goo, chicken fry coolie goo, anything you do. Oh, daddy, grab a cold purple Twinkie. Oh, 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 daddy, fart face. I don't care what the goo.